Hey guys, so I hope you enjoy this video that, that I decided to do for you today. Um, I did a few different shades of purple on the lid, so it is definitely very bright and a very different um, look than I would normally go for. Definitely not an everyday color, um, but I do really like the way that it turned out. Um, it's definitely very fun, I think, for summer or spring, just something different um, and fun to play around with. So if you guys like this video, please comment down below and let me know. Um, I might do some other fun colors if you do, and I hope to see you next time. First, we're going to start out with our clear brow gel, and this is by The Brow Gal. And I'm just going to be applying this to both eyebrows to set them and hold them in place. And this will also help your brow pomade or any brow powder or anything that you're going to be using to set your brows, hold that in place. Then I'm going in with our Anastasia Brow Pomade and this is in the shade Blonde and I'm going to be using just a brow pencil by Crown and this is their Angle Liner Spoolie Pencil and using this to draw our brows in. Then moving on to our eyes, we're going to take some tape and I've applied both of this to the back of my hand to loosen them up and we're going to apply it onto a V shape following our bottom lash line to help give us that sharp edge that we're wanting. Then we're going to go in with our Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer and we're going to apply these directly to both eyelids. Then we're going in with our Gwen Stefani Urban Decay Palette and I'm going to be using this shade right here and that is the shade Skimpy. Skimp and I'm going to be applying this in, to set that Urban Decay eyeshadow primer in the upper crease. I'm not going to be applying that onto our lid because I don't want to set that lid um, primer. I want to make sure that that purple that I'm going to be applying directly onto that is what's going to be um, the highest part of that so that way that shadow is going to stick to that more intensely. Then we're going in with another Urban Decay shadow and this is ACDC and we're going to be applying this one in that crease area on top of that lightest shade. And with this we're just going to be using a crease brush as well. And we're just going to lightly buff this into that crease area. Then we're going to go in with a little bit more of an intense purple, and this is a BH Cosmetics eyeshadow palette, and we're going to be using this purple shade right here, and we're going to be going in with the same crease brush and just applying that directly into our crease on the outer corner of the eye. Then for our main lid color, we're going in with this ColourPop shadow, and this is in the shade Fancy. And we're going to be taking this shade here and using our finger to apply it directly onto our lid. And 
And when you're using a ColourPop shadow, if you're going to be using a brush, you want to make sure you're using a synthetic brush. But I want to pack this on and get the most color that I can out of it, so I'm going to be using my finger. This is definitely not an eyeshadow look that I would do on a normal basis, but for something different, it's definitely a neat different type of colorful and just kind of pop look. And we're going to go in back with that crease brush and just blend this shade in with the others. And make sure that we've used that tape to create that perfect V on the outer edge. We're going to take a blending brush and just blend those shades in the crease and make sure that there's no harsh lines. Then I wish I had some purple glitter, but I don't, so I'm going to try and use some of this um, silver kind of gold glitter. Um, just apply it lightly in the center of the lid and hopefully some of that purple is going to shine through. And we're just going to blend it out with our finger. Now you could apply as little or as much as you wanted with this, um, but since it is such an intense, like bright shadow already, I'm just going to apply just a little bit on the center of the lid. And with some face wipes and clean up all of the extra mess. because it did leave a lot of fallout. Now we're going to take the two shadows, our Urban Decay ACDC and the other BH Cosmetic Palette shadow and apply it on our bottom lash line. And we're going to apply the BH Cosmetics Purple closer to the inner corner. Then we're going to take our Rimmel London Cosmetics Nude Eyeliner and we're going to apply this in our bottom waterline. Then we're going to do a black wing liner on our top lashes. we're going in with the Wet n Wild Mega Lip Gloss and this is in the shade Sun Gaze. And I just want to keep the lips nice and simple just because we did, su did do such an intense eye shadow. And 
and I almost forgot the eyelashes. So I'm going to go ahead and curl those. And we're going to be applying the Light Camera Flashes Mascara. Okay, and that is it for this finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this fun little um, eye look that I decided to do. It is definitely very different, um, something that I would not wear on a normal basis. But it's fun for a pop of color and something different for summer. If you have maybe a different kind of going out, um, doing something different, maybe a concert or something kind of fun outing, um, it would definitely be something fun to do. So I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Please don't forget to hit that like button if you did enjoy it. And please don't forget to check out um, more of my videos. I hope you guys will subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.